What's up, Fit Fam? So, back for another day of at-home workouts, right? Today is St. Patty's Day. Happy St. Patty's Day. Well, actually, it's St. Patty's Day for you guys, but really, it's about like 30 minutes later from the last one that I posted. So that's why I'm in the same clothes. Don't be confused. I promise I shower. Anyways, <laughs> here's what we got going today, all right? So, our warm-up today, if you can see it, which I think you can, three rounds, all right? We're gonna do 20 mountain climbers. So mountain climbers, we are down in our push-up position and we are just gonna bring our knees up past our elbows. So 20, 10 each leg, right? Gonna get your heart rate going, make sure that we're really pressing up through our shoulders, okay? Then we have 10 Kozak squats. So Kozak squat is basically kind of like a side squat, all right? So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna get nice and wide, all right, in a nice big stance, and I'm gonna shift my weight to one side, just like I would and keep my regular nice squat form, come back up, that's one, shift back to the other side, that's two. All right, so 10 total, go back and forth, you should get a nice stretch through your inner thigh, all right, and as well as your quad firing, okay? Then we have five squat holds and press outs. So remember, squat hold and press out, we're gonna drop down to that bottom of our squat, grab onto our toes, all right, and then slowly let our butt come up first, get that nice stretch through our hamstring, oh boy, right? And then stand all the way up. Then you're gonna do five push-ups, all right? So five push-ups, nice, good push-up position, squeezing our glutes, all right? Chest to the ground, back up. If we can't do push-ups, what I want you to do is just do a push-up on your knee, all right? Keep your core nice and tight, go down as far as you can, and then come back up, all right? And then our 20-second chest T-stretch, so you're gonna lie on the ground, all right? I like to get a towel out because um, it's just a little softer than my nice, uh, the hardwood. This isn't even hardwood, what is it? Tile, from the tile, all right? So one hand out, other arm by your uh, chest. You're gonna come up and around. You're gonna hold it for 20 seconds. Get a nice stretch through your chest, right? And then switch sides. So 20 seconds each side. Run through that three times, so it should get you nice and warm and stretched out, right? We're stretching out our chest because this is the back con today, right? We've got a whole lot of burpees, right? We all love burpees. So it's called sneaky. Four rounds for time. All right, I'm sorry, not four rounds for time. Four rounds of two minute work intervals. All right, so in two minutes, you're going to do 30 air squats. Remember 30 air squats, feet about shoulder width apart. All right, toes slightly pointed out. Driving our knees out, weight in our heels, we're gonna squat, below parallel, come back up, making sure that we have full hip extension at this top, right? So 30 air squats. Then in your time remaining of that two minutes, you're gonna do max burpees, all right? And you're gonna do that four times, right? So in that two minutes, you're gonna do 30 air squat, max burpees. Then you're gonna have two minutes of rest. All right, so between each round is two minutes of rest. So really, you have two minutes on, two minutes off for four rounds. All right, so stand around the burpee. As always, we're gonna drop down to the ground, chest to the ground, come all the way up, jump at the top, clap above your head for today, all right? To make sure that we're really getting that full hip extension, all right? So your score for the day um, is your total burpees accumulated over the four rounds. All right, so you can set a clock however you want. Um, I'm probably gonna set one that will be just a running clock up and know that I work for two minutes, right? So I go on the zero. Uh, at the two minute mark, I'm gonna stop. From two to four, I'm gonna rest. From four to six, I'm gonna work again. From six to eight, I'm gonna rest, right? And so forth, because for me, that's kind of easy math, because if you know me, you know I'm not great at math. But that's what we have for the day, all right? So make sure you give it a shot, all right? No equipment is necessary. So if it's nice out tomorrow, then do it outside. Uh, if not, you can hit it anywhere in your house. Let us know how you like it. Make sure you input your score and modify. Uh, and if you have any questions, let us know. Thanks, guys.